I think Alexandra's music, it's like a, it's adding a new character to the film, actually. It has a personality of its own. Well, the score is such a fundamental ingredient of the film. It can change a, a, the mood of a, a, a sequence or a scene so incredibly, so the composer is, is, is a vital component of, of the film. And David Yates works incredibly closely uh, on the last two films with Nick Cooper and on this one with Alexandre Desplat. A new composer brings uh, new ways of expressing those emotions and feelings. He brings a richness, a warmth, an element of darkness, all the colouring and flavour that need to be heightened, not necessarily duplicating what's on the screen and sometimes working in opposition to that, but always augmenting the experience and adding to it. Composing is, is thinking, is having your brain in motion and find what the concept of the score has to be. The, mo the most important thing is for me to find the real thread. Uh, could it be in terms of orchestration, of themes or under themes or motifs that would come or that will come along and, and try to find the arc of the film, the dramaturgic arc. That's the main thing. That's how I start. I sh usually start taking my time to really find the right structure. And Because when the structure is there, when the skeleton is, is really solid, you can just start fleshing it with colors and, and shapes and and it becomes easier. Alexander was you know, the person who we immediately turned to. We all loved his music uh, on such a range of films, and he's an incredibly flexible composer. Small films, big films, dramas, comedies. He's, he's really, he's, he's got such range. And in this film, you know, there are so many notes, no pun intended, but so many elements, so many moods that need to be hit um, with the score. We needed a composer who was incredibly flexible and Alexandre is that. There are many, many notes and many, many different colors that need to be expressed within a given scene. And again, Alexandre is, is fantastic at that. He's incredibly fun. He embraces all the challenges that are thrown at him, never seems so overwhelmed by anything, and takes such pleasure and, and is so enthusiastic about the film and about the process. And of course, you know, the greatest pleasure of all is the music he's written. Because we have this tender, uh, dark sometimes moments, the strings can, can convey that with, with great, great strength. Some of the pieces I've written for this film, they have a, an African pulse, or a jazzy pulse, or even a Brazilian pulse, and you can't really tell because it's played by a classical orchestra, but I couldn't do that in, in maybe in another world of music. With movie soundtrack, I can bring a mandolin suddenly for just one moment, and it's gone. So this world of fantasy allows even more, because not only you have the world of magic where everything is possible, but you have also this extraordinary uh, story of extraordinary people that live together. So there's a world of extraordinary sounds that you can play with. <laughs> 